Hey, it's Mr. Leatherwood, and today I have Charlie with me. Say hi, Charlie. Hello. And we're going to teach you how to subtract two digit numbers. Sound fun? Yep. So let's subtract 35 minus 13. So what I want you to do first is just build 35 for me. Awesome. Awesome. So we got 35 and we're gonna subtract the number 13. Okay. Um, when we subtract, we wanna look at our ones place first. So right now, can I subtract three from what I have up here, from my five. Yes, you can. I can, okay, can you bring three down there? All right, so we can subtract those when we get rid of those. How about our tens place? Do I have enough tens to take away yes, one? Yes, you have enough. I do. Just take one away. Okay, so we can bring this all the way down. And what do we end up having as our answer? We are ending up having Twenty-two. Very good. Twenty-two. So did we have to do any regrouping on that one? No. Nope. We didn't. Not on that one. So let's try one with regrouping. How about if we were doing 51 minus 23? So can you build 51 for me? Yep. Yeah. Okay, we got five tens. We got one in the ones place. And we said we were going to subtract the number 23. Can, in our ones place, do we have enough to take away three right now? No, we do not. So we take away one of the tens and count up a little bit of ten more. There's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. So we borrowed a group of 10, and we still have our group of 10 over here. So now can we take away three? Yes, okay. we can. Very good. Let's move that off to the side. All right, so we're done with our one. So let's go ahead, we can just shoot that all the way down. All right, and how about our tens place? Do we have enough to take away yes, two groups of 10? Yes, we do. So we take away 20, okay. So let's take that away. And, and slide just that slide down. that down, and we have 28. Good. Two groups of 10 makes 20 and 8 ones equals 8. Very good. So that time we had to regroup, right? We had to take from our tens place. Want to try another one? Mm -hmm. It's going to be tricky. Think you can do it? Yep. Right. Let's build 20 and we're going to subtract 4. Can you do that? Ooh, that is pretty tricky. It is, I told you. All right, so go ahead and see if you can build 20. Okay, let's build 20. Okay. Yeah, we don't have anything in our ones place, right? Okay, and we're gonna take away the number four. Okay. Think you can do that? Mm -hmm. Okay, first of all, so we're looking at our ones. We're trying to get rid of four blocks or four units. Do we have any to take away? No. All right, what do we have to do? Take one of these. Okay, so a group of 10. Five, nine, 10. Okay, so we took a whole group of 10. We still have it over here. Now can we take away four? Mm -hmm. Let's move my four down. Okay, let's get rid of that. Get it out of. Very good. Okay, oh, well, hold on. Well, I guess we didn't have anything to take away, huh? Yeah, we did it. Okay. All right, so what's our answer for 20, 20 take away four? 20 take away four is 16. Very good, number 16. Okay, is regrouping tricky? A little bit. A little bit. I like these blocks though, it helps me. I like building it. All right, well thanks Charlie, I hope you all enjoyed it. And I hope you can start using some base 10 blocks to do your subtraction with.